Hi, let's solve one previous question of fifth. This question was asked in GATE CS 2015 set 1 question number 32. Consider a max shape represented by the RA 40, 30, 20, 10, 15, 16, 17, 8 and 4. So index will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now consider that the value 35 is inserted into this hip after insertion the new hip is and 4 options are given. So we will insert 35 as last node let index is 10 35 will be here. Now for index 10 what will be its parent 10 divide 2 it's 5. So for index i its left child will be 2i and right child will be 2i plus 1. Now index 5 is its parent so node is 15. 35 parent is 15. So what we will do we will hippify this. So 15 will come here and 35 will come here. Next what will be parent of index 5? Index 5 parent will be index 2. So it is 2i plus 1. Index 5 is the right child of index 2. Now here parent is 30. 35 is greater than 30. So we will swap these two means 35 will come here and 30 will come here. Now check which option contain this. 40, 35, then 20, 10, then 30. So answer is option B. If you are not understanding this process, let me construct the max shape and in tree format you can insert. So root will be 40, its child will be 30, 20, next 30 child will be 10 and 15, 20 child are 16, 17 and 10 child are 8 and 4. Next we will insert 35, 35 will be child of 15. Now we need to hippify its parent means we need to hippify 15. We will swap 15 with 35, 35 will come as parent and 15 will be child. Next we need to hippify its parent means we need to hippify 30. 30 will swap with 35 so 30 will be 35 and in 35 place we will write 30. Now 35 is greater than 30, 30 is greater than 15. So this is a max shape. Now write in level order it will be 40, 35, 20, then 10, 30, then 16, 17, 8, 4 and 15. It's present in option B so answer will be option B. In any way you can insert Either you can insert directly on RA or you can create the max shape, the tree structure, then you can insert. I already discussed how you can insert elements into an RA. Just go through that lecture, you can easily solve this question. And if this lecture is helpful for you, please like and subscribe. Thank you.